Hey everyone, today we're just going to do a little mini pick a pile using Moonology and our new Frida, inspired by Frida affirmation cards for creativity. I'll also be adding two astrological sign dice and a number dice to indicate any placements or house placements, planetary placements that it may apply to, um, or any energies and attached to you as well. So if you happen to know those, go ahead and focus on the four piles ahead. You've got the pink divination dice on the left for number one, green for number two, purple for number three, and blue for number four. I'll give you a moment. I'll have the timestamps down below. All right, if you have chosen pile number one, we have full moon in Capricorn. The end of a tough cycle approaches. Capricorn may be significant. Or the last full moon in Capricorn or the next one coming up may be significant. If you need to repair something, use gold and be creative. See the value in mending. All right. Energies do we have here? We've got Aries for so April also could be Aries and Sagittarius. Okay. If you have chosen Pile number two, <laughs> you have full moon in Pisces, so it could be the last full moon in Pisces, it could be the upcoming full moon in Pisces, it could be somebody with moon in Pisces in their chart, it could be a Pisces, <laughs> balance spirituality and practicality. Make a journal of your creative destiny, a very beautiful intricate picture of your dreams. Let's roll the dice. No, that took a while. We have Taurus. We have the number six, so it could be six healths. Or six could be significant. And we have Sagittarius. Okay, 250 if you have chosen pile number three. Just write the timestamp down real quick. Let me look at that. A win-win outcome is forecast. Full moon in Libra. Could be dealing with Libra. Someone who has moon in Libra. Could be something that happened last full moon Libra or will happen in the upcoming full moon Libra. Connect to your inner sense of beauty and wisdom. Being grateful for your whole journey. Let's roll the dice. See what other energies this could involve. We have one, could be a house placement somewhere. We have Aquarius and that I believe is Capricorn. Alrighty. At 315, I'm going to write this down. If you chose pile number four, we have be bold and make the first moon move, cardinal moon. Dive into your life, allowing your beautiful words and actions to become inspirational. Let's see what energies you're dealing with. We have Aries. We have, oh, that would be Leo. And... Four, maybe significant, perhaps last April, upcoming April, fourth house. All right, there you go, guys. Have a good one.